Hello everybody, this is Grandpa Scott with today's mini tutorial in Snapseed. Today we will be talking about cropping. First, when you're taking the picture, be sure to never, that means ever, never, ever use the zoom feature in your camera when taking a picture. Either use your feet to move closer or further away or crop the picture after it's taken. The results will be much better. So let's move on to today's lesson, cropping. Today's lesson, we'll talk about cropping. So open your mobile camera and find your Snapseed icon. Mine is right here in the top left corner. So I will open Snapseed, open Photo, and then I'm going to choose Open From Device because my camera or my picture that I want is on my device in my camera roll. So I go to my camera roll and scroll up to find the picture that we want to deal with today. It is right there. I will touch the picture, bring it into Snapseed. And there we go. I notice right off that this picture is a horizontal picture. So I want to turn my phone, shake it so it switches into a horizontal mode and work with this horizontally. So the first thing we do in cropping, very simple. We touch the screen and get the various little notes up from the app. You'll touch this little pencil down here in the right corner and up, up will come a grid of options. You see crop in the top right corner, right up here, so you'll touch crop and then you'll get a bunch of choices. Do you want a free form crop, which means you can set the boundaries? Do you want it to stay constrained to the original proportions? Do you want to do others? There's a four by three, there's a square. I'm gonna pick square for this picture because there you go, it's now set for a square picture. So I'm gonna to touch anywhere on the screen to get rid of this control bar on the bottom. And now I can crop. And as I crop, I'll touch the corner and just move the corner. And you'll notice that I can move the corner anywhere and it stays in a square because I chose square. So I want to then probably shrink this down a little bit and move it in a little bit more. I'm actually going to go for getting rid of all these people over here on the right side of the photo. Make it a little more simple. There we go, give them a little headroom. Now I've gotten rid of all these people. Put the subjects over here on this line. We call it the thirds line for comp composition purposes. And I'm going to click the check mark because I like it right there. Boom. That is the new cropped photo. If, you, if I click this little one square, I can now toggle between the original which has all this mess over here and all this white space and the cropped version which I like much better. So I'm going to no I'm not going to copy that. I'm going to go back to save. Click on save which is right up here in the corner and I want to save a copy so I don't write over my original. And now I'm done. So I can toggle completely out of Snapseed and go back to my camera roll. So if I go to photos, choose my camera roll, the bottom of my camera roll is my new picture cropped. It's easy when you know how, it's easier when you do it yourself, and it's easiest when you've done it several times. So pick a picture and play with cropping. It's pretty simple.